we've joined conservationist and shark watcher Estrella Novaro Holm, who also just happens to be the current Miss Baja California South. For Mark, it's a heady combination. See you later. Good luck. It's a tape measure. I've got the tape measure, don't worry about that. No, we need it. Yeah, you'll need it when you're in. We can hand it to you. And then they're going to have to go straight. Mark? Mark? But how are they going? They've not got the met. So they're, um, they're chasing the shark. And our underwater cameraman is there, too, to get the uh, shots of them, hopefully, measuring the beast. By using her detailed records and by taking a DNA sample... I'm really impressed. Estrella is able to prove that meat turning up at market has been poached from the protected sharks of the Sea of Cortez. There they are. Oh, there's the whale. The whale shark. They're measuring. They're actually measuring a shark. Good God. And by proving that catches are illegal, Estrella is hoping dramatically to limit the impact of poaching on the sharks of La Paz Bay. But this time, before all of the measurements are taken, the shark decides that the encounter is over. God, it was hard work then. <laughs> 21 foot long. Keeping up with Australia is like keeping up with a marlin. It's just impossible. She's, She's so very fit. very good, isn't she? Amazing. I feel like a slug behind her, but... Absolutely. I honestly have to say, I never thought we'd do it. No, I it didn't either. Like, I mean, wrestling eels, it just seemed impossible. While we have proven that the exercise is at least possible, we have not succeeded in getting a DNA sample of the shark. So now we have to wait for our shark to return. Uh, looks like I'm first on lookout duty, then. Yes, for some reason, Mark seems particularly absorbed in his conversation with the current Miss Baja California South. I admire a man with an unwavering devotion to his subject. I'm having at 12 o'clock. I will get you right away. Right below us. Oh, my goodness, that was good fun. Oh. And the dorsal fin length is 55 centimetres. Oh, very good, 55. And did you discover what sex it was? Male. Male? Yeah, you could see the claspers. Right, I don't quite know what a clasper is, but it sounds interesting. It's the <laughs> shark equivalent of a willy. Oh, oh I see. They penis. don't have a, a normal penis. Yeah, well, yes. they have two of them. Really? Yeah. Lucky, lucky. <laughs> and I'm absolutely exhausted. With the measurements taken, Estrella now gets a small sample of the shark's DNA by jabbing it with a pointed lance. 